it's Isaac back with another tier list. So I decided I'm going to go through all the gens, starting with Gen 1, of course. And as you can see by this tier list, there's a lot of Pokemon I like, very few that I dislike. Okay? So, let's just jump into the tier list. We'll start from D and go up to S. Okay, first on D. Graveler. Never been a big fan of Graveler. He looks weird. He doesn't quite look like a rock to me. I mean, he looks... He has, like, these weird, like, flakes or something coming off of him. Really weird. You know, and those big arms and then the small little arms. And not a big fan. Machop, he's supposed to be, like, a huge, like, a muscular kid. But he looks like he's malnourished. He has, like, these ribs. I, I'm, I'm not a big fan of that. Krabby, I just think Krabby's kind of an ugly crab. And he's boring, you know? Venonat, I don't know. Like, what, what kind of bug is it supposed to be? And I don't, the weird vibe of it's, like, weird human, like, Feet, sort of. It's like skin-colored feet. It's, nah, I don't like it. Gobat, does it close its mouth ever? Can it close its mouth? I don't know. Don't like it. Pidgey, Spearow, they're birds. They're boring. They're birds. They're literally regular birds. Like, I mean, sure, Gem 1 wasn't as creative. I mean, they have a goldfish, but the goldfish looks kind of cool. Right? They had a clam. They made it look cool. You know, they had crabs. That look, you know, look kind of cool. But these birds are... Literally, you could see these birds in a different movie and think they were just regular birds. Also, Spiro's, like, fur face, I don't like that much. Aerodactyl, not a biggest fan. I think he's kind of unappealing, you know, kind of ugly. Tangela, I don't, I don't get it. Like, why is he blue and not green? And what, why does he have shoes? It's weird. Anyway, Magmar. I think Magmar's kind of ugly. At first, I kind of liked Licky Tongue. Not gonna lie, I kind of liked it. But now that I realize having a giant tongue, like if this was a real life mon, having a giant tongue out like that'd be disgusting all the time. Kringler, he's he's still an ugly crab, but he looks cooler than Krabby, so that's why he's up there. Oddish is just boring plant. I don't know. Nothing really appealing about it. Onyx, you know, his stats, he, being a giant rock snake, he's kind of ugly. But yeah. Gloom is kind of ugly too. Kakuna. Just thought Kakuna was boring. Sil, I mean, uh, maybe Sil could go and be, but you know, I don't think he's the most has the most appealing face. Do Duo, I don't like it. I don't know what else to say. Neckins, I don't like it either. Don't know why. I just don't. Odrio, I like Georgia. Looks pretty cool. Looks more interesting. Electabuzz, he's fine. In fact, I'll just go through all of these: Zubat, Ghastly, Magneton, Primate, Magnemite, Mankey. Volpix, Neuran, Ponytail, Poliwag, the Nido Arena, and stuff. Arbok, Tentacool, Tentacruel, Ratatata, Kabuto, Geodude, Pidgeotto, Pidgey, Grimer, Juchini, Dragonite, Bellsprout, Charizard, Metapart, Charmeleon. I just thought these guys were all average. I don't hate them. I don't love them. They're average. Dragonair, I think it's very elegant and majestic. I like it. It's okay. Zapdos and Anarkudo, they're legendary birds and look pretty cool. Gollum, he reminds me of like a turtle. I like him. Arcanine, he's very cool. Poliwhirl, I think is cute. Rapidash, it's cool. Shoulder, I think I should. Sorry, I think Shoulder's pretty funny. Drowsy, I love my psychic types. I love the ID he's based off. I mean, maybe he'd go an S, but for now he's A. Marowak, pretty cool. Coughing, he's always happy. He's funny. Hitmonlee, I like his scratchy legs. Cubone's cute. So is Growlithe. Nine Tails, very cool Pokemon. Raichu is very good. I like Clefable and Psyduck, Vileplume, Machop, and Machamp. Very cool. Weeping Bell is funny. I like him. Clefairy is cute. Venomoth, very good moth Pokemon. Farfetch'd, I don't know. I've always liked Farfetch'd. No, it might be a boring bird, but I, I kind of like it. Needle Queen is very cool. Weedle, I, I don't know. I like Weedle. I like its nose. Parasect, creepy, but very cool. Pikachu, he's the mascot. You know he's got to be on here. Golden Seeking. Most people I've heard don't really like Seeking. I think it's kind of ugly, but I don't know. I've always liked it. Star U is very good. Squirtle, War Turtle, good. And he's cute. At first, I didn't like Yuzuki that much. But, you know, Executor being one of my favorite Pokemon, I decided, you know, he's okay. Abra, you know, he's cute. Persian is very cool. So is Tauros. I like Chansey. Lapras is good. Rhyhorn is pretty good. Needle King is awesome. Caterpie, you know, it's the OG bug type. You can't dislike it. Charmander's very cute. Uh, Jolteon and Flare... Jolteon and Vaporeon. Very good evolutions. Eevee's cute. 
Poor guy's pretty cool. Ditto. You know, his thing. He transformed everything. Pretty cool. Ivysaur. You know, the only reason Ivysaur isn't an S is because I thought it was, like, too little of a change from Bulbasaur to Ven Venusaur, I mean. You know? Moltres. My favorite out of the legendary birds, as you can see here. I don't know. It's a fire chicken. I like that. Ammonite. And you can see Star there. One of my favorite fossils, probably they're both very cool. Mew, Mewtwo, awesome psychic types, very cool. Snorlax, love Snorlax, I mean, who doesn't? Flareon, Flareon is definitely my second favorite evolution, and my favorite out of all these three. My first being Espeon, of course. Pinsir, I've always liked Pinsir, I don't know, it just looks cool. Star me another psychic type, and I like Starfish. Gyarados, you know, who hates Gyarados? I mean, you can't. Kabutops, very cool fossil. Very good fossils in Gen 1. Except for Aerodactyl, I don't like him that much. Magikarp, who hates Magikarp? No one, right? Magikarp's awesome. Hitmonchan, I, I, like, I do boxing myself. I like boxing. And Hitmonchan, he's good. Jinx, I know people hate Jinx, okay? But I like Jinx, okay? I like, I like Jinx. Scyther, very cool Bugmon. Electrode, you know, Electrode and Volpsir, people kind of say they're kind of boring, you know, but I've always liked them. Mr. Mime, it gets hate a lot because it's kind of creepy, but I love Mr. Mime. Seedra and Horsey, very good seahorse Pokemon. And Kangaskhan, I love its theme. I mean, it is a little weird that, you know, whenever it hatches out an egg, it has a baby, and it doesn't make a lot of sense, but it's still cool. And there's Volto, we already talked about him. Polyrath, it's a buff frog theme. That's, that's pretty cool. Hypno. One of my favorite psychic type, probably it's very good. Probably not in the top ten, but definitely definitely somewhere high. Weezing, I've always liked Weezing. I kinda like weird eccentric Pokemon, you know? Like some Pokemon that people wouldn't like because they're like, I don't know, based off garbage like Garbodor. I love Garbodor. One of my favorite mods. But yeah, I kinda like weird Pokemon. Haunter, I like Haunter. I actually like Haunter more than Gengar, which you see is right next to Cloister and Executor. Executor, or you probably said this a few times. I really like the idea. It's based off of like the coconut, the, the tree that grows faces. I really like that. And it's just one of my favorite Pokemon. It always has been. Cloyster. I think Cloyster is a really good like clam Pokemon. I think it's it's really cool. Anyway, let's see. Victory Bell. Victory Bell is cool. And also in the anime. I liked how it bit James and stuff. Uh, Alakazam and Kadabra. I mean, they're the, like the OG psychic types, right? You think psychic, you think Alakazam. That's why I like him. Golduck. Wish he was psychic type, but he's still cool on. Paris, I always thought Paris was kind of cute, you know? Sanchu, probably one of the cutest mods of all time. Besides Alolan Sanchu. Oh, sorry about that. And then Slowpoke and Slowbro. You guys already know this. My favorite Pokemon. Of course they're up there. Muck, I've always loved Muck. The first time I saw Muck, I was like, that's a cool mod. I love Muck. Now, he's a pile of slime, but he's a cool looking pile of slime, all right? Doug Trio. I like Doug Trio. I mean, maybe it has a weird evolution line. There's three more Diglets, but I like it. Dugong. Dugong probably... Dugong has nostalgia. That's why it's up here. I used it in my XD Go Darkness playthrough. I loved it. It was amazing. Had, had a wonderful moveset. Amazing. Jigglypuff. Very cute. Sorry. And then over on the Tear Maker thing. You probably can't see him. I have first one, though, is Meowth. Love Meowth since the anime, you know. That one's a Diglett. I like Diglett. I like their trio, you know. Rhydon, very good looking Mon. I think they kind of ruined Rhydon with Rhyperior. I didn't think Rhyper uh, Rhyperior looked that good. Uh, Wigglytuff. Ah, it's it's good. I like it. It's cute, like I said with Jigglypuff. Sandslash, very cool looking Mon. Raticate. Now, lots of people probably don't like Raticate. It's kind of an ugly rat. But I always like Raticate. I like, you know... Firo, very cool bird mon. I like using it. I don't like Spiro, but Firo, we're all right. Beedro, it's, it's a very good bee Pokemon, you know? Like, they could have gone so many different ways with a bee, but they, this is this is the bee. This is awesome. Blastoise and Venusaur, both very good. Definitely two fantastic Gen 1 mons. Only one way I don't like Charizard. I don't like Charizard. Gets too much love, and I didn't like him from the beginning anyway, so, you know, yeah. Butterfree, it's an OG bug type. Can't dislike it. And Bulbasaur. Bulbasaur. I always choose Bulbasaur if I'm playing through Kanto. Most likely, sometimes I choose Squirrel. But I love Bulbasaur. So, yeah. That's it for my Gen 1 tier list. I hope you like, guys enjoyed. If you're not subscribed, please subscribe. And press that like. And I will see you guys in the next one.